mouth and is like, I'm a bad Jew. Then he turned to me, even though he knew I was keeping Passover, hands me the box and goes, want one? The title of the play and the sense of the use of the word in the play refers to the young generation today, Jews who have grown up um, with grandparents who have maybe come from Eastern Europe or of a Holocaust generation, and, and Jews who have, you know, grown up with being given a Jewish identity. And it's kind of this thing that goes on, you know. And if you deviate off of what's more commonly practiced in a traditional sense, that you're such a bad Jew. So an example would be bacon, for example, is not on the list of kosher foods. Now, most secular Jews eat bacon and being still yet very culturally Jewish. I didn't know you were an online dater. The, uh, what? I would love to see your profile. I deactivated it. Oh, he must really like you. I wish you had it. A, a lot of people do it. It's not something to be embarrassed about. It's very normal now. It definitely is. There's just this reflection of what it means to be young today and how we connect with that older generation. And so it's set in the present time and it just feels very real. And I think exposing kind of that private thing, those things that you would only really say in the comfort of family, where underneath it all, it is about family. You are, um, you love them kind of regardless. It's this unconditional love. But watching these young kids kind of um, come to terms with the death of their grandparent and fight about what's most important to them in this this really, you know, uh, no holding back way is is really awesome for someone to watch. And, and I think you talk about it after for days. If I had gone skiing for spring break, despite knowing that my grandfather was basically on death's door, which I would never have done, but if that had been me, if that go. had been me, I would have been calling in every day, three times a day, at least, to check and see, and <laughs> at the very least, I would have told my mom where I was going in the event of an emergency, which the pending death of the most important person in your family is like the reason the word emergency was invented in the first place.